All right, eight seconds left. The Hornets are down by three. No three pointers. Please. You sons of guns. All right, what is going on, everybody? Welcome back to the Cedric Lewis My Career. And last episode, we faced the. I already forgot who we faced. I already forgot who we faced. We faced the Timberwolves. In that game, I ended up quitting early because I actually I didn't even quit. I fouled out. Um, yeah, I only played seven minutes, seventeen points, five rebounds, and six fouls. So seventeen <laughs> points, five rebounds, and seven minutes is ridiculous. But we ended up losing that game by twenty-four. We were getting destroyed. Um, yeah, D'Lo, Shea could not guard him. Cat went off when I went to the bench. So bad game. But now we go up against the Charlotte Hornets. Who hopefully we can get an easy win. LaMelo Ball averaging 18 points in his rookie season. We're going to be going up against Cody Zeller, who's having a solid season. So hopefully an easy game. Um, in this save file, I'm not going to update all the trades. So whatever already happened in this franchise happened. Like I know Kyle Kuzma got traded to the Heat in this one for Avery Bradley. So whatever. I'm going to leave it as is. I don't care. But we're going against the Hornets. And if we go to look at the player stats, we can see that Cedric is now averaging 26 points after we simmed. 26 points, 17 rebounds, 6 assists, and a block and a half. Shooting almost 50, 40, 90, 37% from 3. Um, Shea is averaging 17, 5, and 6. Um, Karan is averaging 16, 5, 5 and a half, a block, and a steal. Jay Rich averaging 11. So, team's doing what they got to do. We traded for Daniel Gafford uh, to play off the bench. I think we traded Michael Scholar or something. And that is really it. We didn't do any other trades besides getting Danny Gafford on this team for defensive purposes. So let's go up against the Hornets and hopefully we can catch a dub. Oh, I forgot to mention, we also picked up Isaiah Thomas, but I actually think he's hurt. So there's more bench scoring. All right, here we are in Charlotte going up into the 16 and 18 Hornets. Kind of similar records. We're 18 and 13. Uh, they played three more games than us, but very solid. Kind of like what they're doing in real life. Gordon Hayward, LaMelo Ball, the whole gang. I am going to put um, Karan on LaMelo matchup wise. So, he's at the small forward, so that means Shea's going to have to guard whoever that small forward is. So, I don't know who's a small forward. Gort I might put Jay Rich at small forward, actually. But, yeah, I'm going to end up putting Karan on LaMelo. I really don't trust Shea guarding him. It's been a while since I've been on this Cedric Lewis, so a bit rusty. But, Hayward's going to try and go to the paint on Shea. I don't know why Shea's guarding him. I will leave Cody Zeller wide open. I have no issue with that. I think he can shoot, kind of. But I will leave him open. We're giving it to Shea now. He's got the mismatch. He's he, very late. Oh, my God. I'm on the fast break. I'm going right to the rack. It's P.J. Washington, and he's going to play solid defense. But I'm on the offensive boards, and I'm missing again. Oh, I really thought I, I should have hit that. I am one for five to start this game by early. I have five rebounds. And my controller's dying. Sick. We're at one for six right now. Both teams have scored two points in like four minutes. That is really bad. None of us can hit a shot. And I can't grab a rebound. Jesus Christ. This is awful. But I am faster than Cody Zeller. And I'm going to get that layup over LaMelo. Kind of hoping it was a dunk. Oh, Jay Crowder got to steal on LaMelo. LaMelo ball. Not a posterizer, but he contested it. So, I mean, thumb, thumb, that's not thumbnail. Oh, we got 18 in the game for the first time. Let's get it. Oh, great pass by Devontae Graham. 95% contested. He made it. That shows that I'm not on an easy difficulty. Also, that Timberwolves game also shows it. But we got IT in the game for the first time. I'm going to set him the screen and see if he can do anything with it. He's not going to do anything with it. Give it back to me. Give it back to me. I'm a, that's a really deep three. Yeah, that's, that was dumb. Currently have a 14-point lead. IT open for mid, and he greens it. His second points of the game. He's got four on the night. Gives us a six-point lead. Uh, it was a very crappy offensive game for both sides, but we're starting to heat up. The Hornets aren't doing bad themselves. I mean, with a minute 30 left, they have 14 points. I think, you know, they'd like a bit more, but, I mean, they got their bench unit in, and this bench unit doesn't have much scoring as Karan almost gets a steal. Oh, and I'm getting subbed out. Okay, sick. Yep, okay, I blocked. Yeah, I have, like, three blocks on the game. I'm getting subbed out. Let's see, we were up by six. We're up by 11. You'll love to see it. On the fast break after a Gordon Hayward miss. Shea is going one-on-one. -on -one. Oh, Karan, why are you taking a three? You can't shoot threes. Your shot three tendency is so low, but he still shoots them for some reason. And why is Karan not guarding LaMelo? I have him on LaMelo, and I jumped. I'm so stupid. PJ Washington on freaking Jake Crowder, and Jake Crowder locked him up. Uh, 
Okay. All right. I did not want to pass to Jay Crowder. That's not what I want. You're going to put me on LaMelo? All right, let's go. Nope. He's scared. Nope. Oh, you fouled Kar God damn it. Here are the current Eastern Conference. Oh, it doesn't matter. We're not in the East. I forgot. Well, the Hornets are the 8th seed if you care. Uh, Miami's 18 and 13 and they're at the 6th seed. So that's that's weird because we're 18 and 13 and we're at like the 4th seed in the West. So the East right now is looking better than the West. Okay, I can't believe I bit on that pump fake. Nope, it's now a 7 point game. Hornets aren't going down without a fight. Uh, I don't know what what plays were Quran. Can you stop taking threes? All right, Gordon Hayward on me. I'm going right into the post. Right into the post. Gordon Lamelo's one for six. Oh my God, Jay, you didn't box out your. Why was? Why are you still sitting in the paint, Jay? Yeah, I'm in the post and Lamelo's wide open for three. He missed. I was in the post and all of a sudden it's like, I right, let's just let's just say screw it and go right to the paint. I'm like, come on, Josh Richardson, only twenty, uh, only twenty-seven percent covered. He bricks it. Well, we're going to timeout, but the Hornets just push it to a four-point game. Yeah. Gordon Hayward just hit a three. Yeah, he celebrate. You can celebrate, big fella, because it's now a four-point game after we were up by double digits when I got subbed in. And Okay, I'm still in the game. I kind of thought I was going to get subbed out there. But no. One-point game. Miles Bridge just hit a three. It's a one-point game. A, what went from an 11-point game is now a one-point game, and both teams have that bench in besides me. Besides poor old me. And IT straight to the basket. Easy layup. Gives us a three-point lead. We're starting to shoot somewhere now. IT, that was a big sh Well, a big shot. It's only the freaking second quarter. But, yeah, he's playing good so far, I think. <laughs> At least when I'm playing with him, he's playing good. Bismack, you can shoot that. I am fine with that. Devontae Graham. IT's giving up a little bit too much space. Miles Bridges. Yep, easy bucket. I Because if I went to go contest him... Bismack would add an easy um, offensive rebound and put back. That, that's the annoying thing. Ten seconds left in this first half. Currently up by four. I hit a, I hit a pretty good three. It was a green. I don't know. If this is some top tier commentary. Oh, Devontae Graham gets a good look and he misses. We're going into the half up 56 to 52. We were up by double digits, but that disintegrated real quick. Two point game. Shea's been doing great. I think he scored like five straight points already now. Uh, mainly from my screen. So, see? Look at these screens. These are some... Screens should count as assists. You know? He ain't, he ain't getting that bucket if I don't set that screen. And that, that's just facts. He ain't getting that bucket. So, Boucher's been balling out. I think he has 16 now. Uh, Karan kind of clamping up Lamelo a bit. And Lamelo has to pass it out. Um, Jay Crowder's been playing really good defensively this game. I have not been playing great defense on Cody Zeller. Uh, he has like 16 or 18 points. Yeah, Terry Rozier missed. Don't know why he was open either. Um, Shay, you got Rozier on you. I am going to set you another screen. A great screen again. And Shay, it has like eight straight points. He is dominating this third quarter. Oh, it's a tie game. I just noticed. I can't guard Cody Zeller. I can't. I don't know why. He has 20 points. He's pump faking me out of shots. That's an awful shot by freaking Gordon Hayward. I can't grab rebounds because every time I go to grab one, it's contested. Like, Cody Zeller is bodying me as he gives me an and one. But Cody Zeller is outplaying me right now. Well, now the Hornets have a chance to take the lead on this possession if they want. It's a tie game. IT just missed a three. So, if can we stop giving... Mo why are we giving them so so much space? Like, Ludor, why are you giving Malik Monk a freaking 17 feet of space? He's, he, he's going to get a shot off, isn't he? He's going to... Yep, yep. Watch that go in. No, it doesn't. But Cody effing Zeller almost got that rebound. Like... What is it about Cody Zeller that he's just freaking balling like this? Shay, why are you running into Isaiah Thomas? I don't I don't understand the AI in this game. I don't. I really don't. IT, right by Devontae Graham. There we go. Giving us a bit of a cushion. Only a two-point lead, and we're facing the Hornets. And, yep, there's their first lead. No one can guard Malik Monk. Whoever's got first lead of the night. Whoever's guarding Malik Monk. Just gives them so much space for some reason. I don't understand it. That's going to be a charge. Oh my god. This game is just infuriating. I'm getting subbed out. We're down by one. Bench. I didn't expect this to be a close game. Bro, if this OKC team doesn't start playing defense, I'm going to lose my mind. Bro, we're giving up such easy mid-range shots. That's going to miss, isn't it? If it's not a green, say it with me. It won't go in. 
That, that's literally 2K21 next gen. If it's not a green, it won't go in. It never does. It's so stupid. It doesn't make any sense. And, oh my god. Watch Cody. That kind of was a surprise. Cody Zeller didn't get that offensive rebound over me. The way this game's been going, he would get that over me. And then why would you pass that after I'm giving you a screen? Why would you shoot that? Why? Why would you shoot that? Look at this. I have an ISO. I'm mellow, all right? I'm going to put him in the post. Look Look at Jay Crowder not going to the three-point line. So, freaking Cody Zeller can get an easy block on me. I had to take the shot farther away because Jay Crowder didn't let me isolate. Did, that, what? If, a, if your center has a mismatch on a point guard, why would you take the matchup, the switch, into the paint where the center's trying to go in the post? Makes no sense, right? Of course. Yo, are you... Are you... Are you serious? Are you serious? The Lamella Ball just made that shot. Are you serious, 2K? That's not even my teammates or anything. That's just 2K being a trash game. You're lucky you made that, but I was hoping for three. But that's just 2K being a trash game. It's that simple. We have a chance here to take the lead if Jay Rich hits the shot. And he does. Thank you, Jay Rich. We now have a one-point lead with two minutes left. I didn't. I actually legit didn't think he was going to hit it. But the way this game is going, this freaking OKC team is making it difficult for me to want to resign. I'll tell you that right now. Unless we can get... I was going to say a third star. It'd be a fourth star if Quran actually decides to play basketball. As great defense by Jay Crowder. Th this this team is making it difficult for me to want to resign. Very difficult. Come set the screen, Jay, because apparently everyone wants to give me the ball. And Jay Crowder wide open in the paint. He makes it and gives us a three-point lead with a minute 40 left. And there it is. P.J. Washington ties it with his probably his first three of the game, to be honest with you. And, of course, it comes now. Oh, my God. Like, there's no defense. There's no defense. Do I, I do I need to switch like, coaching settings to play tight? Please. It's not going in, is it? If it's not a green, it won't go in. Gordon Hayward is freaking bullying Jay Rich. Good defense. Freaking doing about 17 spin moves. Why are we giving Malik Monk so much? Why are we giving him so much space? And then I get a defense of three seconds because they're just standing out on the three-point line. I can't, oh my god, this game is so, so annoying. All right, 104, 106. Oh my god, I fouled Gordon Hayward. He only made one free throw, so that's something. Uh, can I get by Cody Zeller here? I don't know why I did that little hezzy, but I got by him. Of course, I don't get the foul call, um, but I got by him and completely murdered Malik Monk. Now, if we could just play defense, we'd be fine. So, please play defense. They don't, oh, they do have LaMelo in the game. Guard, just play defense. That's all we got to do. Jay Rich, you already got blown by. You are so lucky he just missed that. You are so lucky he just missed that shot. And now we can get the game winner. Now we can get the game winner. Someone come set me a screen so I can get the, sw um, the switch. I got the switch. I'm going right to the rack. And one! Let's go! We can take a three-point lead. Eight seconds left. I probably could have waited a bit longer, but I just, I wanted to get the shot. I'm going to miss. I made it. 109, 106, eight seconds left. That could have been the game winner, unless LaMelo or Gordon Hayward has something to say about it. All right, eight seconds left. The Hornets are down by three. No three-pointers. Please. He missed. You sons of guns almost blew that game. Why was he wide open? Wide open. This can be... That's it. The game's over. Why was Malik Monk wide open? Explain that to me. I don't I don't understand what that defense was. I don't care that I missed. We won. We won. It's over. 2-1. He's going to hit the half court. Even if he makes it, it doesn't matter. Clutch from Cedric Lewis. Wins OKC the game. 110-106. to Left Malik Monk wide open for the game winner, and he missed it. This this team defensively, they they are killing me. Final box score: Cody Zeller. I literally could not guard him. Twenty points, seventeen rebounds. Uh, Gordon Hayward had a great game. Lamelo Ball didn't play great, but he played all right. Um, Cedric, thirty six points, twenty six rebounds, five assists, and three blocks. Only two turnovers. Didn't shoot well, but I, I tried. Uh, Shea had 21. He played good. 
Um, IT off the bench played really good. 13 points. He didn't do anything else, but we don't really need him to. Wayne, so these two off the bench just killed it for us. So that's good. In eight minutes, he had 11 points. Four for six from the field. Three for four for three. That's exactly what you're on the scene to do. Karan, every time we play a legit game, Karan doesn't do good. So I'm just used to it at this point. Jay Rich, seven points. Jay Crowder, seven points. That's what I expect from them. They both hit, I'm guessing, a three. Yep, that's literally why they're on the team. Basically, off the bench, only took one shot, two points. Gafford, you're on this team to get blocks, two blocks. So, other than that, that's going to be for me. Leave a like, enjoy. Subscribe, guys, are new. GG.